Are you tired of always playing the same old things? Uh, no. Yes, you are. You choose. I play the series where I will be choosing the most retarded suggestions of champions and playstyles. Because metas are too mainstream. Y-C-I-P, Y-C-I-P, I'm just kidding guys, what is going on? Gubsito here, bringing you the first episode of Y-C-I-P slash You Choose I Play, um, a new series on this channel where I will be featuring your ideas on champions and playstyles, lanes, um, that I'm going to be uh, playing in the next episode. Um, basically, you suggest a champion and a playstyle. And the the comment with the most thumbs up or the comment that gets the most ideas uh, will be played in the next episode. So you guys, I, I got a lot of suggestions. I got over 40 suggestions, but you guys wanted me to play Tank Annie. I think it got four thumbs up and two comments. So that's pretty good. I'm playing with a friend, and he's going to come in for the gank because he's a jungler, and he's going to come in for the gank right here. He's playing Aatrox, the new champion, and... Um, I got my stun up right here, and we get vision on him. I'm gonna try to stun him right here. He's gonna get his passive up, I think, um, because we're gonna dive him. I'm gonna waste my flash, and right here, I think that I'm not gonna get the kill, but the passive is pretty weak, so he's gonna hit, hit that, um, nice ability, and I'm gonna get the Q on him for the first blood. Very good start. <laughs> and tank any top. You might be thinking, oh, that's, that's stupid. You know, she's, she doesn't have any... Why, why would you play Tank Annie? But the reason being is her E. Kind of like Ramus, uh, where she get, he gets that armor and magic assist. And whenever people attack him, uh, he attacks them back. Or they get they get some AP damage back on their, themselves. Kind of the same thing with Annie. Um, her E does that. If someone attacks you when you, you got it um, active, um, they take damage. So right here he's gonna come in for another gank, kinda babysitting my lane. I'm gonna get my stun up uh, right before he ganks. Good communicating right here. I'm gonna go in with my Q for the stun. He's gonna come from behind, knock him up with the W. Sick ability for Aatrox, just so overpowered. Kinda like Malphite's ultimate really. He's gonna do the same thing. He's gonna start attacking me, but it's okay because uh, I got so much sustain and the with the help of minions and I think my E, we're able to pick up the second kill in lane. Right here, I'm not gonna pay, pay much attention because Fiora is coming in for the gank. Uh, I did have the word up, but I didn't I didn't uh, pay that much attention, so I get killed. Um, I will be getting a bit of AP. I will be playing tanky AP, mostly tank. And I'm gonna get, um, oh, by the way, he's coming in for another gank right here. And he's gonna knock him up. Uh, we're gonna try to chase him right here. He's very, very low on health. He's gonna go uh, down with his uh, passive. It's really hard to kill him right here because I don't have my stun up yet. Uh, he's gonna slow me down. I don't have any flash. I don't have anything. So this is kind of a... Uh, cool trick that I do right here. I, I make uh, Tibbers go there and I'm gonna go from the other... Uh, side, so we're gonna get the kill very easily. Me and Tibbers, nice help from uh, my friend playing in the jungle with uh, Aatrox. He's gonna kind of babysit my lane a lot since um, tank any it's not very, very easily to play, you know, solo. So I'm gonna get the thorn mail um, for the, the passive, which is epic. Um, you know, it's gonna do damage back on them. And that combined with the E is going to do so much damage when he starts attacking me. It's crazy. Um, I don't want to break any rules. I will be building quite tanky, but I'm going to get the Relies Crystal Scepter. I'm going to try to aim for that. Uh, it's the only AP item that I uh, will be trying to get this game. Right here, he's going to come with his W. And now, just look at this. Just look at this. I'm going to pop my Tibbers. I'm going to use my E. Look at this. So easily, I can kill him so easily with my E. Um, he's gonna do damage back on himself, and Tibbers is gonna help me out a lot. So that kind of shows really how strong uh, this is. Like, it's it might be not, you know, it might not be viable for ranked and stuff like that, but it's still pretty good. I think you should try this out. And the guy who suggested it, he said that he's been playing this um, a couple of times, and he's been doing good with it. And it's, it's you know, it's not every day you see this. Um, I thought I played a few games. I think I played four games, and this is the best I got. Um, or maybe three games. Um, 
but I mean, it's you know, people. I, I thought that I would get more, you know, flamers and stuff in queue that would say, "Oh no, don't don't play any top. That's fucking stupid. Don't don't do that." Uh, you know, but I I didn't get a lot of hate. You know, uh, some people were like, "Any top? Okay, really." <laughs> but you know, when I failed, I I you know, in the other games, it was quite hard. So I I kind of failed. But here we're gonna come in, and I'm gonna use my tears for the stun. He's gonna get the kill. Very, very nice right there. Um, but, you know, I didn't get any flame uh, just because I failed in the other games, you know. It was quite cool, you know. So, right here, we're going to get the mid tower. And I'm going to head up uh, for... I'm, pre I'm pretty fed right now. So, I'm just going to get this blue. Um, Atrex is going to help me out. And I think I have the gold for the... Um, what is it called? Thornmail right now? So I'm going to get that, and the E with the Thornmail combined is just going to be crazy. The damage output when they attack me, it's, damn it, it's going to be nice. And you're going to get, you're going to get some uh, nice proof of that uh, later on, where I'm going to show you that. So Yi shows up in the top lane instead of Aatrox. I'm not sure where Aatrox is right now. Uh, my friend is going to come in for another gank. Lux is here as well. He's going to go for the W. Nice knock up there. And I think he's going to pick up the kill. Yeah, No, I'm going to pick up the kill. Very nice. And I'm 5-1. and one. Pretty nice. <laughs> Look at this. I'm just going to farm. I'm just going to let Tibbers farm at top. And I'm going to take these golems. Just a nice way of split pushing with your <laughs> friend Tibbers. So we're going to go for the second tower top. Winning this lane pretty easily. And Aatrox is going to go in with his W. Nice knockup. And I'm going to be able to stun him, I think. I stunned him earlier. He's gonna get the kill. I'm gonna block the uh, ultimate from Caitlyn. Very, very nice. But they're gonna keep chasing us. I do have the Thorn Mail, so uh, I really want to try it out. You know, I want to. I want to see when what happens when Caitlyn attacks me. He's gonna go back. Very, very nice engage. He's gonna get a double kill right here. Very well done by my friend. And so Fiora kind of camping at the turret. I really want to try out my uh, Thorn Mail and. Uh, uh, e thing, so I really want to get uh, an AD champion to chase me. You know, I played a couple of games with this, and the first game I think I played uh, was against Top Cinched, and that kind of sucked because you really want to play against an AD champ, kind of like Aatrox, just a perfect matchup for this um, th this uh, playstyle. You know, any tank top, you, you're gonna get slammed if you're playing against an AP champion since your E is not gonna do that much. Um, you, you really wanna get someone that does damage with their basic attacks. So, Atrix is gonna go in. I'm gonna stun him. Um, he's gonna get the kill. And almost getting killed by that Caitlyn ultimate. And I'm gonna chase Caitlyn. I'm gonna flash for a basic attack, but not that's not enough to kill her, unfortunately. Uh, this is a pretty fast game. Uh, we're going to go for the uh, first inhibitor, 22 minutes in game. They're going to try to chase us. Master Yi, this is where, uh, this is a pretty funny part. Uh, they're going to try to chase me. I really want to stay uh, in there because I, I really want to see what happens. Look at this. Fiora is going to try to chase me. She's going to get slow for my relies. Um, I really want her to dive me because I want to see the, the effectiveness of my E and Thornmail combined. Look at this, she's doing so much damage back at herself, she's gonna dive. I could use my Q right here just to pick up the kill, but I didn't want to. And I thought that I would get the kill by the turret right there, but Cassidy is gonna come and secure them both. So that kinda sucks. Um, I kinda turned around stupidly enough to get killed by Yi. Uh, not a very good idea. Uh, I'm gonna head top again. Atrix is uh, in a bit of trouble right here, so I'm gonna teleport top to this minion. Uh, Fury is gonna stay in there. We're gonna go in right here. I think he's got his passive up. He, he's gonna go in right there and knock them both up. Okay, he didn't have his passive up, but he's gonna get the kill anyway. Also, if you hear us talk in the background, that's because we're pre made. Um, talking Swedish, so that's just if you're wondering. Um, I'm, I I want to try to get the carries or the Yi and Caitlyn to chase me because I really really want to try this out. Fiora coming with the home guard. I think she's gonna pick up the kill on uh, Jana or Caitlyn is. I'm not sure. See here, I go back just to see how much damage I can deal to this uh, Caitlyn. Cassidy is gonna secure the kill on Caitlyn, and we're gonna push for some turrets. I think no, we're not. Yi is gonna try to chase me. 
I'm going to stun him. He's going to keep chasing me. Um, Lux pops her ultimate, and Fiora is going to pop her ultimate. Impossible to escape that. So that kind of sucks. Uh, Kazanet is going to go in for the kill on Lux. So I kind of failed to farm this game because it's pretty hard to f uh, farm with Annie since she doesn't have a lot of, you know, I, I didn't buy a lot of AP. Um, I was I was building quite tanky and I didn't I was wasn't going AD or AP at all uh, in the landing phase so that was pretty it was pretty hard to farm even under the turret so that kind of sucked. Right now this game is slowly coming to an end. We're gonna pick up this turret and hey aim for the nexus. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to leave your suggestions for the next episode. Um, I will pick be picking the best suggestions that you thumbs up and um, I'll see you in the next episode or the next video. Peace.